run for president, what kind of ideas would you represent? that we're beings with engineering opportunities. I would represent just as you served a platform here, there's something that happened on my last run that I thought, I feel, I know was brilliant. It was noisy, but it was brilliant. I had one rally and in the rally, I just let people come up and I gave them a platform. It's our responsibility to listen to the pain and hear the pain and understand even when We're the ones that cause the pain, like with my tweet. It's my responsibility to hear you and understand why you feel like that. But it's our responsibility as a people to understand each other. To give people a voice. People need the voice. And even right now, what I'm doing or how God is using me, I'm showing where our voices are being muted. There's professors that are actually intelligent, actually have multiple degrees that have been canceled from their schools. And they don't have a music industry or a fan base or a shoe design or a smoking hot ex-wife to complain about. They've just got the truth of what they saw and what they dedicated to this country and to education that has been muted by schools that have been taken over with an agenda. And so you want the brightest minds to be these professors, and then you mute them, and they have nowhere to go. And you might get a guy now that went from being someone's favorite professor to he's working at Starbucks like, like he was back at school or like he was back in high school. So even if that voice is about anger and hate, it still deserves to be heard. Yeah, it deserves to be heard. And we deserve to ask why. You know, like you have to ask why. I just feel like that's what's, I feel like that is sympathizing with Mr. Hugecock. I'm just saying (laughs) that it just needs to be. (laughs) You should change that to your name on Twitter. (laughs) <laughs> While you're still allowed on there. <laughs> yeah. I, do you think they got, that would get censored? I feel like they, you know, they definitely cut it down some inches. Uh, the, I'm, I'm pointing out this, <laughs> I, I'm pointing out this truth. Now, I'm serious. This is not a Christian thing, right? Uh, and, you know, I wonder right there, when I say these jokes, is it something that I, cause I do feel like laughter is the key, engineering and laughter, right? Is the key to 